Chris Gaines here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to create a dope, surreal effect in your videos. I'll basically be breaking down the effect that was used in the video for Occasion and Keith Ape's song, Underwater Bank. So let's hop straight into it. We're going to create this effect in two basic steps. The first is to invert the original footage so that the highlights become shadows and the shadows become highlights. The second step is to blend our inverted footage with our original footage so that the original colors are retained above a certain brightness threshold. I have the clip that I want to add the effect to on my timeline, and the first step that I'm going to want to do is duplicate it. So I'll highlight it, press Ctrl C, select track number two, and press Ctrl V, and I now have this duplicate directly on top of it. The next step is to select the top track, go to our effects tab, and add an invert effect. As you can see, this gives us a really nice, crazy, surreal effect. Now let's bring a little bit of realism back into this image. What we're going to do is go to the Opacity tab in our effects controls and select the Blend Mode Difference. As you can see, we already have a lot more of the original colors popping through in this first part of the clip. However, we need to refine this so that we have more control over what is actually being inverted. The way we're going to do this is by adding a luma curve effect to the top clip. Essentially what this will let us do is control the black level that's going to show through as an inverted white color. What I'll do is add a point right about here and then drag it down. Notice how I now have full control over how much of the image is being inverted, simply by clipping the levels at the bottom of the Luma corrector. So I'll dial in the way I want it, play it back, and there we have it. You can apply the Luma Curve effect to each individual clip so you have full control over how much of the shadow effect is being inverted. And that's it, a really simple way to create an awesome effect that's great for music videos or edits, anything that you could think of. If you like this video, leave a thumbs up, or leave a comment down below, and subscribe for a lot more video tutorials coming very soon. Until next time, peace out.